All right, well here's the uh, chicken tractor we've been using as a puppy tractor. They've been out on uh, in the shade, on on pasture, so to speak, with the big dogs in the but in the chicken tractor the whole time. Today I decided to let them out and let them have a little bit of a free for all. I'm trying to get to his water, but they're having a big old time here. Big old time. Share a little puppy love with you today. Mama's been very careful. They've uh, introduced themselves to the other big dogs. There's Lolly in the background. And uh, very skittish and, and leery of these puppies. And uh, the male, Ozzy, the dad, beat a hasty retreat. He's nowhere to be seen. He gapped it down there somewhere and has no interest and in, ran away from them right away. Uh, but Lolly's, Lolly's sitting in the background. Where is she at? Uh, right back in there somewhere. Yeah, but um, the pups are getting their first explore out in the real world, and uh, I don't think it's going to do any harm, even though I thought Effie had weaned them, the mama, Effie right there, had weaned them. They're still clamoring for milk, and she's letting them suckle, so I don't know. I'm new at this, you know? What do I know? We're just going to do the best. That's Mr. Blue. He's, he's still available. This is Miss... Uh, can't even tell anymore. But the puppy's out having a romp, having a good time. Exploring the world a little bit. This feeder, by the way, while I'm here, I should tell you. Uh, I bought this based on Greg Judy's example. I got this automatic feeder and it's been working great to train them because all my livestock guardian dogs are going to go into that. So it's free choice. They can eat all they want. They haven't been eating that much. Uh, feeding time by hand was just such a pain. And now that we've got this automatic feeder, I think it was about, I don't know, 50, 60, 70 bucks or something like that tractor supply. I'm not getting paid for the sponsorship, but I, this, so far it's been working really well. We've got to come up with a better watering system and I've got another one coming. Tough, tough land or something like auto, automatic water or water is coming soon. I'll post a video of that. But we've just been putting water in Tupperware jars and they've been really, really thirsty. But anyway, this, by the way, for anybody that's interested, is, is the Suskovich, John Suskovich chicken tractor that we use. We bought the plans and then we built these. Uh, they're really heavy, but they are sturdy and they last a long time. Anyway, that's it for now, and uh, updates later.